because it happened to someone who's so dear to me. I've seen the process of ups and downs that cancer entails. And I've realized that one, um, you know, there is no awareness because there's so much stigma. We don't want to make ourselves aware. We don't want to, um, you know, there's, there's been so much medical advancement. Most of the cancers are preventable today. A lot of them are fully curable and that's, all that is great news, but we don't even want to, um, you know, engage with that because cancer feels like I guess like TB was in the 30s or AIDS was in the 80s. It was something that you just don't want to think about. You know, but I think that we, uh, while, while early detection and all that will help prevent cancer or will help with better treatment, I think what's also what we're not acknowledging is a contribution of stress to the creation of cats in the body. I'm speaking from a layman's point of view. I, but am I right, uh, doctor? Because I think, um, you know, our lives are so hectic. We also, at times, when we're feeling unwell, we just, there are so many pressures on us that we don't, we keep telling ourselves, me, I'll do the test. Later. This happened to someone very dear to me, which is why I'm saying. You know, he, he was traveling the world and he kept saying, Nene, but I have to go on this tour. When I come back, I'll do it. When he came back with something else, when he, until, you know, the signs were very, very clear. The signs were clear that there was something wrong and then action had to be taken. So, and thankfully in his case, I have to say that uh, he's been responding to treatment very well and is well on the way to recovery, inshallah, for recovery. But the point I think that they're making today is that all of that can be prevented or at least mitigated if we take action in time. And uh, I, I also feel very strongly about one thing which I'm going to share with you. I know that HM Reliance is doing great work in every area. But I was wondering if there is any way in which, you know, a hospital like HM Reliance can engage with corporates to make sure that regular testing for various cancers happens for their employees. You know, because what happens then is one, it's, it's beneficial to the employee and also to the employer. And also, um, because if you know someone is dealing with something like this, you will also figure how to support that person. Because a lot of times what happens is when someone is detected with cancer, the person feels pushed under the bus because suddenly everything in their life changes. And you know, honestly, it does not have to change. So I think we need to really work towards getting rid of that stigma associated with cancer. It does not have to be as scary as it sounds. It is not as scary as it sounds. So um, prevention, taking care of stress, and building awareness, I think. And this is only a lean and talking doctor. I hope you don't mind me, uh, you know, waxing eloquent about this. But I, I just feel very passionately about this. Um, so I think all of this will help us in moving towards a cancer-free society. I hope someday it is like AIDS is today or TV is today. You know, even if you have a cancer, it's no big deal. So I, and for all those who are going through treatment, cancer treatment, here or elsewhere, for all those who are here, I wish you the very best. I wish you a complete recovery. I wish you and your family lots of strength. And a big thank you to the oncology department at HM Reliance Hospital and to all the doctors and the staff here. God bless you all. More power to you. Thank you so much, Vidya. Those were those were very spontaneous and and I should say inspirational words because when you speak about stress, I think I saw my dear wife was sitting. I just thought I would I would quickly recognize a, a few individuals this evening, and I uh, and I think it's important to do that because then all of us may not may, may not you know so. So I want to I want to first thank Dr. Dr. Sivanti for I see in the first row 
Mrs. Priya Dutt, and thank you so much for being here. And it's going to be a wonderful uh, uh, panel discussion that we'll soon engage in. I want to thank every, each and every one of you who has. I think a lot of cancer was there. It was not. Yeah. It, it's not my thing. So, so yes. So I think I, I appreciate that in each one of you to have uh, solicited your support for for this cause. Uh, so, so let's get on to the next very, very uh, important and interesting part of the evening. And I would request there are designated panelists. Uh, at the same time, everyone is is encouraged to stand up, ask questions, participate. Ma'am, sir, can you please come? Ma'am, sir, can you please come? Can please come? Yeah, look here. Thank you. 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 Yes, today is World Cancer Day and this is a very good thing that HN Reliance Hospital, Dr. Hari Bhakti and the team have started this program which talks about prevention of cancer. You can stop the cancer from being able to stop the cancer. But you need to know about it and what is the knowledge that you have to test your time and time. और अपने सेहत का ख्याल रखें जो चीजें कुछ चीजों से परहेज रखें वो तो हम सब को पता है कि औरतों के लिए औरतों में ब्रेस्ट कैंसर सर्वाइकल कैंसर कॉसेस आर प्रॉब्ली द मोस्ट कॉमन कैंसर्स अमंग्स वुमेन अमंग्स मेन इट्स ओरल कैंसर तो उसको प्रिवेंट करने के लिए आप क्या कर सकते हैं वो तो हर एक की जिम्मेदारी होती है अपने तरफ अपने लाइफ की तरफ अपनी जिंद गुड हेल्थ की तरफ है ना पर I think it's very important also to get timely tests done. और अगर कभी-कभी silent cancers भी होते हैं, तो पता ही नहीं चलता कि किसी को cancer है, तो अगर testing की वजह से पता चलता है, तो जल्दी treatment शुरू किया जा सकता है। तो इस सब के, I think it's a great program and I, I hope, I, I, I know that they're hoping towards a cancer-free world and these are baby steps, but I think steps in the right direction. Fitness, diet, a stress-free life, lifestyle आपकी बहुत जरूरी होती है। किसी भी disease को prevent करने के लिए stress को दूर रखना बहुत जरूरी है। पर हम सब इतने stressful lives जीते हैं, तो you know whether it's heart disease or diabetes or cancer, इस सब का you know stress से बहुत stress का इस इन सब पे बहुत असर होता है। या stress is one of the causes so we have to try and lead better lifestyles or processed food jitna hum log kam kam khaye utna acha hai hum to ab kuch bhi kha lete hain you know hum bombay mein especially aisa hai ki aate jaate hain waqt hi nahi hai kisi ke paas exercise to dur ki baat ho jati hai most for most people kyunki is bhagam daudi mein aap you know train pakad rahe hain kahi ja rahe hain wahi pe aap thoda sa so jate hain train mein all this contributes so I think exercise, good nutrition, a stress-free life, and regular checkups are very important. Sathi, today's youth are growing up very fast. I'll talk about tobacco, I'll talk about cigarettes. They're growing up very fast. They're growing up very fast. Actually, I think this is not just youth. The young people are very fast. They're growing up very fast. They're growing up very fast. वगैरह मैंने कुछ स्टैटिस्टिक्स पढ़े हैं पर अब ज़्यादा यू नो मतलब नहीं कैंसर के शिकार हो रहे हैं एक बात है और दूसरी बात है कि उसके बारे में जानकारी ज़्यादा है ना कि अच्छा इतने इतने प्रतिशत लोगों को 
यू नो सिगरेट की आदत है या तंबाकू की आदत है वगैरह वगैरह पहले ये जानकारी नहीं थी हमारे पास पर आई थिंक ओवरऑल अगर हम स्ट्रेस एलिमिनेट करें तो हमारे हैबिट्स भी बेटर होते जाएंगे पर ऑफकोर्स ये कहना बहुत आसान है पर आई थिंक इट इट हैज टू बी अ होलिस्टिक अप्रोच वो सवाल पूछा आई थिंक इट्स अ वेरी इम्पॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन क्योंकि सबको ये जानना चाहिए कि अगर मात्र एक चीज तमाकू हटाई जाए तो 50 परसेंट कैंसर और कैंसर रिलेटेड डेथ चले जाएंगे सो so ये सबको कहना है कि 50 परसेंट वो सब वो सबसे बड़ी अपॉर्चुनिटी है प्रिवेंशन की कि हमारे इसका कुछ लेना देना नहीं है हमारे कल्चर में हमारे जो काफी वो क्या कहते हैं उनको जो बनारस के घाट पे वगैरह बैठते हैं वो भी करते हैं तो ये कल्चर की बात नहीं है अपने सेहत की बात है और ये सबकी निजी जिम्मेदारी होती है हम यहाँ बैठ के किसी को एडवाइज़ नहीं करना चाहते कि आपको ये करना है आप खुद अपने लिए कुछ करो अगर आप लंबी ज़िंदगी जीना चाहते हैं सेहतमंद रहना चाहते हैं तो ये आपकी जिम्मेदारी है मैं आपको नहीं बताऊंगी कि आपको क्या करना है पर आप पर ये निर्भर है कि आप किस तरह की जिंदगी जीना चाहते हैं साथी मैं बात करूंगा फिल, फिल, फिल्म की तो शाहरुख खान की पठान मूवी है जो बहुत ही नहीं 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 लेट्स ओके हां ये हिट साबित हो रही है बॉलीवुड के लिए बहुत ही अच्छा खबर है बहुत अच्छी खबर है बॉलीवुड के लिए और मैं शाहरुख खान फैन हूं तो मैं बहुत खुश हूं मैं पहले ही दिन गई थी उनकी फिल्म देखने और शाहरुख दीपिका जॉन डिंपल कपाड़िया आशुतोष राणा सब ने कमाल किया डायरेक्टर ने सिद्धार्थ मल्होत्रा ने सबको बहुत बहुत बधाई विद्या जी आपकी भी पिछले साल मूवी आई थी जलसा काफी सुपर डुपर हिट हुई थी लोगों को काफी अच्छी लगी आपका किरदार तो वाकई काफी अच्छा था थैंक यू आपका हमेशा किरदार तो अच्छा ही रहता है इसके अलावा 2030 में क्या कुछ दो रिलीजेस दो रिलीजेस हैं लवर्स और नियत अब कब रिलीज होगी उसका मैं फिलहाल बता नहीं सकती क्योंकि काम चल रहा है पोस्ट प्रोडक्शन चल रहा है तो आपको पता चल ही जाएगा फिलहाल तो मैं कोई वेब सीरीज कर नहीं रही बट आई एम ओपन में वेब सीरीज की कहानियाँ पढ़ती रहती हूँ अभी तक कुछ अच्छी नहीं लगी मुझे थैंक यू थैंक यू Yes, look here, everyone. Dada, thoda picha na. Are you coming?